Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be unboxing and playing around with the Cocoas Neon Markers line. Um, these are all non-white colored gels and they're a little bit of a thicker consistency so it's perfect for when creating nail art lines or if you want to add texture too. I'm going to show you a nail art design that you can do with these so i'm excited to get into them we'll start with looking at each of the colors um and then we'll get right into the tutorial so the first color that is in this collection is a white which obviously is essential and it's a thicker consistency you can see like it's taking a long time for it to kind of move through the pot um whereas like the other gels kind of just pour not like super runny but you get the gist um the next color is this black also very very essential now we're starting to get into the color so the first color up is this neon pink it's a stunning stunning shade of pink it's not even it in the bottle it looks or in the jar it looks similar to the the container but it's actually more of a, a brighter pink i love it i think it's perfect for the season that we are approaching because everyone loves fun summer nails the next color is this neon orange and this is your tried and true highlighter orange so i'm excited to play around with that one that one's really cute next up we have this neon yellow yeah, this one is also very fluorescent and I love that for the summer, especially on tanned skin. I'm speaking for myself because this color, fire. And then we have a neon green. This is really nice. It reminds me of Cocoa's um, neon toy green as well, but obviously this one would be a thicker consistency and again, it's non-wipe so you can... You don't have to put top coat over this. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna show you some cool designs that we can do with um, the markers line and specifically non-wipe color gel. So, hmm, which colors? Let me think. For the sake of being fun, let's go yellow. Mm, orange, we'll go with orange. We're going orange. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna put the rest to the side and then I'm gonna get my tip together. I'm going to be using everything Cocoa West for this um, tutorial as well. So I'm going to be using the Ultra Diamond Non-Wipe Top Coat and this is a really, really pretty fine glitter. Um, I love it. I don't use it as often as I need to, but Obsessed. You see how they just kind of like capture and shine? Obsessed. Sorry about my phone. All right, so let's go ahead and paint one coat of this non white top coat, ultra diamond non white top coat. Very cute, very galactic. And it's not like that glitter that's like super in your face. It's very subtle. By the way, you can use this as a top coat. So say you want, say like you don't have a glittery pink or a glittery blue and you don't want to buy glitter um, in every single color, you can just purchase this top coat and have what you have so you can make the best of what you have and always put this on top if you want that like glittery look. And the best part is you don't have to put a top coat after and you don't have to wipe it after. So this one kills like three birds in one stone. Love her. Okay, I'm gonna put this in cure for 30 seconds. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to be using is this gold liquid mirror gold chrome from Cocoas. It's from the liquid mirror collection. Oops. And I need to shake it before using it. So I like to do back and forth and then tap on my hand. Um, this technique I recently saw on the editorial nails Instagram page. So if you're not following her, you definitely should. She has tons of gorgeous, gorgeous 
designs but she inspired me to do this um, as a base so the glitter and then this chrome and so I'm just gonna show you some cool things you can do with that idea and then with the markers line so this is cured fully cured and I also have my sponge here ready to go so I'm just going to take this chrome and brush it on I'm gonna give it like a hot five seconds to like air out and then I'm gonna take my sponge and start rubbing it back and forth oh, I'm obsessed with how it looks okay I'm actually going to use one more coat just so we can get like full coverage and I wanted it to be on the sheer side so that's why I don't have a base color underneath. I just went right in, but of course you can use the base color if you'd like. So I'm just gonna let it like air dry a little bit. And then I'm gonna take my sponge and wipe back and forth. Okay. So let me just close this. And the next step would be to come back in with the Ultra Diamond Non-Wipe Top Coat. And we're going to put another coat. This is what's gonna give it that super, super dazzly effect. We can definitely thank the editorial nail for this stunning look. It's like a good go-to base. You can do so much on top of this. Y'all see this shine, I know you do. Wow, it's so beautiful. Okay, I'm putting this in for 30 seconds. Okay, so this is fresh out of the lamp, and I have my neon orange here. I'm just gonna grab my palette so that I have somewhere to put my gel on. Okay. And then I'm also taking my long liner brush from Cocoist as well. I'm just dipping it in and I'm starting to set it up here so I have a good area that I can refer back to. look how easily that swiped on and that is the beauty of the markers line the thick gel and then it's non-wipe so we can have texture on our nails easily on our clients nails on our nails i love it okay i'm gonna go through and finish with the look the goal here was grid lines, so that's what I'm going to do. I do wish there was a little bit of a longer liner brush in the Coco Ace line because it makes it tough to get crisp lines on longer nails. Um, but you can check the link in my description box for a really good liner brush. This is amazing, this is amazing, but um, if you want something a little bit longer to add to your collection as well, I like having um, one of everything. So you can check that and there's a good one in my Amazon storefront, so the link is in the description box. This brush is good for like smaller fine details. So I'm being overly ambitious with this one. But nonetheless, I got three grid lines down and now I'm just gonna go um, horizontally. I'm actually, before doing that, I'm gonna grab a little bit more. I 
I know you guys see that. <laughs> That's okay, I'm gonna use my cleanup brush to clean that up though. Easy enough. And that is that. All you have to do is cure for 60, or sorry, 30 seconds, and you will be good to go. There will be no top coat necessary. If you don't like texture, then of course go in with your ultra glossy. Um, and that will help with the texture. And otherwise, it's good to go. So I'm gonna cure this and other. I figured, you know what, let's just spice it up. Let's just Let's just add a few more things. So I'm gonna take the thick whites um, and I'm also going to take my dotting tool. I'm gonna dip it in here. I like to reinforce so that I have, a, like I said, a little pool. So I'm just dipping it in here and I'm gonna tap one dot here. And then I'm gonna do another here. Taking that same long liner brush, I'm gonna ever so slightly dip it into the pot. You can see almost nothing. And then I'm gonna run it through that little pool so we can connect the bristles. Yeah. And then I'm gonna take that through those dots so we can make a little sparkle. Just gonna grab a little bit more so my brush is thorough. <laughs> Cute. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna cure this because I love how it looks. It's so cute, so fun, so colorful, and there are so many different elements. Lately, I've been feeling nails with lots of elements. So we have the chrome, we have the sparkle, we have the neon, we have the sparkles that we drew, the little faux stars. Okay, I'm gonna put it in for 30 seconds. So here we have a design idea for the markers. See, once you take that blue, once you take that blue peg off, which is holding my tip, it looks so much nicer. Yeah, so here we have a design idea to go along with your Cocoa's Markers Line Non-White Color Gel Collection. And again, these are all neon colors, so it's perfectly good to add to your collection for the summer obsessed with her put it on my nail now <laughs> anyway let me know in the comments if you feel like this is something that you would get like i said non-wipe so this is good to go this is good to go and you're ready to wear your nails out or send your client off with their nails out good to go Everything Cocoist, super easy, super quick, super fun, using the Markers Non-Wipe Neon Collection. Everything is linked down in the description box. If you'd like to pick this up, you can use code PRECIOUS10 on the entire Cocoist website. And don't forget to check out other resources I have for expanding your nail art and nail skills in general. I have a nail art vault where I will show you how to do more in-depth nail art designs and then I also have a gelex course where you can learn how to do either self-applied or client application gelex so thank you so much for watching